course, K Pisces from kpisces.com. And I'm here for your January 2016 Love Edition Love Scoop. So here we go. Let me tell you what I feel about you while I'm shuffling. I see someone who is excited about love, new possibilities. I do feel like there is some um, old pain that you may be wanting to just wipe out because you see that relationship as being something that is over. I think that um, you guys will be... I see you shaking almost in anticipation and excitement about somebody else somebody new or not so new but whatever and I think that um you want to blend yourself into this person I feel like by the third week of January you're gonna be excited about the possibility but try not to rush in but kind of make, making your feelings no okay so let me just do the card High Priestess, Two of Swords, the Glare, Five of Swords Reversed, the Chariot, and the Ace of Cups. Ooh. Okay, Taurus, so what I feel about these, it's like I said, you getting to the, you got this feeling and you think this person may be good for you, alright? You're... You go into the month, I feel, because you've just come out of something that was painful, okay? I think you're going to say your goodbyes to this other person, even though it's still kind of on your heart. Because, I mean, we all human right happens. And, I, and you're not going to use this next person to heal what's going on, what happened between you and the last person. It's almost like emotionally, even though it's a different person, you're going to, like, pick up where you left off with the other person, with the new person, not in some kind of immature way, but kind of like in a way like, I know what I want, so are you gonna do this? Like, this is what you want? That kind of thing. And I feel like, like I said, through the, towards this is the decision that you're gonna make. I feel like you don't know that you're gonna make this decision. You don't even, the beginning of the month, like up until the third week, fourth week, I feel like yeah, maybe into the second week of Feb. I feel like you 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 don't even notice. You don't even know you're about to make a decision. I guess you know now. <laughs> and I think that you're going to be going towards this thing and you're something about this person is going to spark in you. It's going to turn something on. Something is going to change between you and them. And I think that you're going to uh, The way it feels okay with this ace of cups I, f I just feel like and this also i feel like this high priestess could be a person as well male or female you feel like this person is for you and and you're going you're going to go for this love with this person okay i really feel like this can this is something that's really sweet with the page of wands here i think that's you you know asking them is this what you want? Like, I want this. I think that you may be the person that I want to do this with. Do you want to? You know, do you want to be together? Do you want to get married eventually? Do you want to, you know, be with me? Because I'm serious about what I want. And I think that either this is happening to you. I mean, you're doing this or it's happening to you. With the Eight of Wands, this relationship can move really fast. But I really feel like this person is really trying to see what it is that you want. I think that they're not up in the air, but just knowing that they need to take it slow. And I don't mean slow as in five year fucking being together, engagement, never married. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about take it slow as in wanting to see if you're ready. Cause I feel like they may know that you just come out of something that was painful, but 
I really feel like this person, even though you're not using them as a rebound, will be somebody who's better than the last person. And I think that somehow it's going to heal your heart and you didn't even see it coming. Ooh, that's nice. Mm. All right, Taurus. Well, Kate Pisces is from kpisces.com. Check me out for tell all those bar reading. No lies, no lies, no lies. Honey, you want lies? Look at America's. I ain't got nothing for you.